हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल माय नेम इज विश्वास तैताल आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग फाइन लेट्स सॉल्व टुडेस प्रॉब्लम फॉर लीड कोड द प्रॉब्लम नेम इज फ्रूट इनटू बास्केट्स सो इट कम्स अंडर मीडियम प्रॉब्लम इज मोस्टली आस्क्ड इन गूगल सो लेट्स गिव अ लाइक सो यू आर विजिटिंग अ फार्म दैट हैज सिंगल रो ऑफ फ्रूट ट्रीज अरेंजिंग फॉर्म लेफ्ट टू राइट ओके द ट्रीज आर रिप्रेजेंटेड बाय अ इंटीजर अरे फ्रूट्स वे फ्रूट आई इज अ टाइप ऑफ अ फ्रूट द आई ए ट्री प्रोड्यूसिस तो वी विल बी गिवन एंड वी विल गिवन एन एरे फ्रूट एंड वेर फ्रूट ऑफ आई इज अ टाइप ऑफ अ फ्रूट दैट आई ए ट्री प्रोड्यूसिस ओके सो यू वॉन्ट टू कलेक्ट हैज मच ट्री हैज मच फ्रूट हैज पॉसिबल हाउ एवर द ओनर हैज सम स्ट्रिक रूल्स दैट यू मस्ट फॉलो तो वॉट आर द रूल्स हियर यू ओनली हैव टू बास्केट्स and each basket can hold only uh, hold a single type of fruits okay so there is no limit on how, on amount of uh, fruits each basket can hold okay this this is one rule starting from any tree of your choice you must pick exactly one fruit from every tree so we will be given a type of tree in the array and we have to pick only one fruit from each tree okay moving from uh, right the picked fruit must fit in one of your baskets okay once you reach a tree which uh, fruit that cannot fit in your basket you must stop okay given the integer fruit return the maximum number of fruit you can pick so here we have a rule like we are given only two basket which can hold only single type of fruit so we can we can have only two types of fruits okay and there is no limit uh, no limit on the amount of fruit each basket can hold so there is no limit how many fruit we can put and here they told starting from any any tree of your choice you must pick exactly one fruit so they are, this is a type of the tree and we have to put, we have to take only one type of uh, only one fruit from each type of tree okay and then we have to give a answer let's see so we are given here example fruit One, two, and one. Okay. So what we'll do? We will first create. What we'll do? We will first create a basket one, basket one, basket two, basket. Okay. We created two basket here. They told we can create only two basket, and here they were told only we can have. Uh, well, only we can have. Uh, single type of fruits okay so this is uh, one tree this is one tree so we can pick only one fruit from this guy we like in second rule they told we uh, any tree you can you must exactly pick one fruit so this is type one tree so we will put we will take uh, one fruit from here and here type two tree so we can't put in here because this is assigned has type one tree So we'll go and we'll make another basket here, and we'll name is has two, and I'll pick only one fruit here. Okay, another this one. So one is already there here. So I'll put and pick the tree here and one. So total how many tree? How many trees we? Uh, how many fruits we have in a basket? One, two, and three. So we the answer should be here, three. So do we get here three? Yes, we are getting yes three. So we understood this problem. Let's solve another problem here. We have here. first we will create two basket we will create two basket okay we will change the color so this is uh, type one type one tree so we have to pick one fruit here we will put one fruit here now what comes type two comes we will go and we will pick two here this is only we have to take only one tree now this is assigned has type one basket This is assigned as type two basket. Here again we got three here. So what we'll do? We will remove the starting index. We'll remove the starting index. So what we'll do? We will remove the starting index. We'll make this guy empty. We'll make this guy empty, and I will say this is a type three, and I will put this three here. I have removed this one from the tree. I don't want this fruit. I want now three fruit. So now next was two. So two is already there. So I will put another here one. I have already one here, and another is also two. So I will put another one here. So total how many fruits we can have? One, two, three, four. 
so we can say we have four trees four uh four fruits we can have at most so we are getting here four three okay let's solve this problem how we can solve this we can use here a sliding window how we can use sliding window see this we can use two method we can use map also we will use array here because it will be uh, our time time will be very like it will run faster than 90 percent so we will use array okay now what we do here i will just drop this so what we'll do here first i will see how many types are there so first what i will do i have to see how many types are there so at first what we'll do here i will create an array list i will create an array of the size of fruit so how many size what is the size of a fruit here one two three four five so five it they can have five different types of fruit at most at uh, like at most they can have five different types of fruit so we will create five here one two three four five okay now what we will do we will go and see here we have one here so we will go and add one to here we will go and add this is here zero and uh, no, we can say one two three four and five what we will do here we will go and add one here so we'll go um we'll go add one here so actually it start from zero right so we will say zero one two three four five huh we will go and add one here so we will increase the element because we have found one fruit so we'll go add one here and what is the type here we have how many types here we we till here how many types we can see we have only one type okay so what is next element next is two we'll go and increment the two value and here how many types we can we can have we can have we have two types of tree here okay now we are met with another which is three so three three is going and keep uh, three is going and keep adding here but we can say here we can see here we have three types of tree but at max how many how much how much we can have at max we can have only two basket so what we will say we will remove the starting element we will remove the starting element and we will uh, like to remove the starting element what we will do we will do minus one we will do here minus one so minus one plus one will be equal to zero okay so now we have how many uh, like removing this guy removing this guy removing this guy till here how many trees we have we have two comma three so we have how many types we have two types of tree here we have two types of tree okay next we have another tree which is two so we'll go and add two here and it, it is already there so we don't need to say the type has increased we have only increased the uh, fruit in the basket so here another two another two is there so we will go and we will increase the type here by another one so three so it satisfies the formula the type should be here two only two types should be there uh, here only two two types of fruits can hold and uh, and we can have how much how much how much ever fruits we have so the answer will come to we will go and add this and the answer will come to four i hope i'm clear here so let's solve this problem so what do we need we need first a count array so we created here count count array so we have a count array okay new int here the size of will be equal to the size of the length fruit length okay after that what should we have we should have um, uh, we should have the types of uh, how many types of trees are there so we will have how many types of trees are there okay now what we have to do we have to return maximum here so we have to say int max equal to zero okay after that i should have current max i have to keep updating uh, what is the current value so current max is equal to zero and also i should remove the starting element of this guy so i should have a track of every element from this so i will say 
int start will be also starting from zero now what i have to do i have to iterate to the array and if i see one here i have to go and add one to the this one so i will go for int i equal to zero i is less than fruit land i plus plus and what i did here first i have to say is the type i have to add type then i have to add to the this one so first i will see if how we can see it is a new type uh, we can say it is a new type when it is zero here when we have we didn't add anything in the basket we can say this is a new type of uh, new type of fruits so if uh, count fruits mm, i is equal to equal to zero then do one thing increase the value of type okay so if it is zero we will increase the type so as we can see here when we started here at one so we see it uh, it was already here we see how we do it again we can say it's already zero 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 so we uh, we will first check if uh, it is zero if it is zero then we will increase the type value okay if it is already zero then we will increase the type value okay after that what you have to do then we have to go and increment this value we have to go and increment this value we have to go and increment this value okay after that we will do count um fruit i plus plus after that what i have to do i have to say uh, we have one fruit in the basket now in this when we have one fruit in the basket so what you will do current mask um, max is equal to plus plus okay now i have to also check in this case uh, in this case what we did here so if i go and add here also one uh, is added here one and the type will be equal to now two so now what i have to do i have to remove one so how we can say it for for like for what function we will use it we will use here while the type is equal to so i have to run this uh, loop while type will be equal to less than 2 till then we have to run this okay so what i will say it should be uh, it should be less it should be equal to the 2 till then you have to run this so what i will do here i just missed a mistake r so what i will do here if i find while type is more than 2 if it is more than 2 just do one thing remove the starting element and i have i have to also check the shards should be and i have to also check start should be less than the i value okay so it should not go above here you should stop at here only i it should be less than the i value so now first what i have to do i have to remove the value i have to remove the value for that what will you count fruit start what is start here start is here zero so we will remove the first element of the array so whatever we found the first in the uh, first tree we will remove the starting okay after that what we have to do we have to do minus minus okay and then if in this case i removed here zero i in this case i removed here it zero it came i removed one tree here and it becomes zero so now how many types are there in this we have so I will increase this guy. We added three here. How many types are there here? We have two types of tree here. What we'll say? If copy this guy, paste it here. If equal to equal to zero, then one type of tree has been decreased. What is decreased? One type of tree has been decreased. I hope I'm clear here. After that, what I have to do? Obviously, the current max will be because we removed one tree here. The current max will be decreasing here. 
after that what you have to do and we have to increase the start value we have to keep on going forward okay so now we will return the now what left if we have to reassign the max value we will use the function mat dot max between max comma current max and we will return you will get a max value return max i hope i'm clear here we have to iterate to the like it should be less it should be short it should not go more than two that's why we are using this function and this function start should be less than i let's run this if you find some error you correct it yeah we're getting error here okay let's run this yeah it's getting accepted so let's submit and see yeah it's getting accepted okay i hope this is clear let's do a dry run for this once so we have i have already uh, put it here so we will do a quick dry run so the array is here uh, 0 comma 1 comma 2 comma 2 so this is an example for second one it is an example for the second one let's see we get output has three here so what we'll do so the length what is the length of the fruit here length of the fruit is 4 we go down and the max is equal to 0 and uh, current max is also equal to 0 and type count equal to also 0 and the start will start from 0 okay now I have to iterate to the array and see if the count is equal to 0 then what you have to do we have to increase that type value we have to go and increase that type value so now the type will be reassigned to the 1 because we have found one fruit of a tree and after that what you have to count uh, we have to increase the value in the count so this guy will be increased by 1 yeah it is increased to 1 here uh, it was 0 okay now we have to do current max max here we will see is the type more than uh, 2 no so what we have to do we have to skip the while loop so we will go down and see what is the max value the max will be now equal to 1 okay now uh, now the uh, now i now it will be uh, equal to 1 now see let's see the type count equal to uh, like the, this is a different t this is 1 this is 0 and this is 1 so this is different t so type will be now equal to 2 the count uh, fruit will be also increasing here and this will be now 1 so let's see like 1 comma 1 and the current uh, max like how many we have in a in a basket we have almost 2 in the basket okay now i will see why the type count is more than 2 no it is equal to but it's not more than 2 we'll go down we'll skip this we'll go down and we will say start dot max now the max will be equal to 2 okay now here the type count now we have i is equal to now we have array equal to 2 so in this case the type of count what will be here the type of count will be equal to now 3 now here count fruit will be also increased and here here the one will be included so 1 comma 1 comma 1 and the current uh, max is equal to 3 in this case it is 2 the type count is now more than 2 the type is equal to 3 now it is which is more than 2 and the start is less than 9 so it is also true then what you have to do we have to remove the starting element so it will be now count will be here 0 so I have to remove the count value which is here 0 then what I have to do if count dot start is equal to 0 if if this is equal to 0 then we have uh, we have reduced the type here so here if it is equal to 0 in this case if it is equal to 0 how many types are there now we have only two types of tree so we'll go down we will say start max and we will uh, we have taken one fruit from the basket so we will say uh, current max less less so here it is false now it is run again so it will return the maximum the, uh, the maximum output is here three and we are getting here output as three okay i hope you understood this um, approach and if you like this approach please give a like and if you like this video please also give a like and subscribe to my channel it will be great help and thank you for watching keep coding chalo bye